Hello everybody and welcome. Very exciting news. As you can see to my right, I have constructed a trap. And if you look over slightly to the left, you will see a level 20 Rhino Natha that I am going to tame. And over there on the right is my friend Yippy. They are going to be helping me tame this Rhino today. I have my Rex back at base that they gave me. And here we go. I am very excited to see how this all plays out. Let's get this thing's attention right now. This is my first time taming, taming, taming a Rhino on official settings. So a little nervous about that. I imagine it's going to take quite a while to wake up. And it is, ooh, it is aggroed. It is very, very aggroed. Okay, is it following? Yes, it is right behind us. The plan is uh, to lead it into this trap. No, it's starting to lose focus. Oh. The plan is to take it into the trap and trank it out. Let me, I guess I'm gonna help this prime meal real quick. The plan is to tame it, or sorry, crank it out, uh, just for the simplicity, and then damage it. And as you can see, Yippie is over here giving me a hand, I'm trying to just kill the Parasur. Okay, there we go. Let's get the attention of the Rhino again. Give it a quick little chomp. It is only level twenty, which isn't the best of levels but that should work for the purposes of let's see if this works okay will it follow us into the trap this trap is, was made by yep yeah, it should work it should work there we go 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 and it is trapped all right there we go this trap uh, was uh, Captain's Vet Dog's trap. So now to trank it out. Uh, this trap is designed to offer protection from the Rhino. So you can get up close and personal and do your thing while it is on. Ooh. Well, it's supposed to offer protection. Oh, I'm an idiot. It's supposed to stand over by the, the railings. Not too close. It is unconscious already. That was surprising. Oh, it is very weak. Very, very weak. Uh, I'm going to go back to base and I'm going to grab the Rex. This, let's see. I hope he doesn't, doesn't shoot it. All right, let's see. Ooh, I hope I can get back in time with the Rex. It should be it should be plenty of time. This should be a fairly short video. Hopefully, hopefully this goes as smoothly as it could go. I think part of the reason it went out so quickly is because uh, Yippie was shooting it too. The only problem is getting the Rex all the way over there in a uh, timely manner. But we should be able to swing that. May may have been a good idea to bring the Rex over uh, at first, but that that won't be a problem. We will get it over. It was a what, level fifty three Rex, I believe. Ideally, I was originally I was just going to use a trike, but this probably works a lot better for taming the Rhino. Let's see. Does it pop up? I know you can't really tame it, but does it pop up? No, it doesn't pop up. This level 20 Rhino is just a, a start uh, for the Rhino, but that is great. We got it unconscious. That was, that was really spectacular. Now just to... Excuse me, now to get back to base. Here we are, back at base. 
Don't forget to grab the pheromone. I almost forgot that actually. Let me see. There's Rhino Kibble. He looks quite similar to my three adolescent Rexes. As you can see, they are almost grown. I do have two Rhino pheromones. I'm going to grab the first one just because that is most likely the best, oops, the best one to grab. Jeez Louise. That's probably the most effective, I would say. All right, and we are going to take good old Rhino Kibble over there. That shouldn't take too long. I am most likely going to cut all of this out just for the sake of simplicity. So I'm going to cut it here, and once I get back to the Rhino, I will pick it up from there. So a uh, little bit of an oversight. So this is the Rhino. It's got about 199 health, uh, 138, sorry, 100, 300, 1,382 Torpor. I'm Rex over there, which I'm excited about. Uh, I didn't realize how long they take to wake up, and I did not realize that you can't access their inventory to, uh, yeah, to wake them up. So this is going to take a little bit longer than I thought it was. I'm really hot. Oh, so yeah, I'm going to have to wait all this time for it to wake up, but that's okay and i will let you guys know how it goes in a little bit okay and we're back the rhino natha now has about 45 torpor left very uneventful 20. This is the time that it took to woke up i went to three shifts of work i took a trip to another city i filed my taxes went to the gym and I built a small plane. But after all that time, it is finally waking up very soon. He should be awake, awake. Almost, almost. I did take its health down just a little bit. I'm pretty sure it has to be below 200 health. I'm going to let it get to maybe 10. Ugh. I do have another pheromone in my fridge or my uh, preserving bin. And I think next time I'm going to try to find a high level one. I know this is really like level 20, so the baby is going to be very pathetic level wise. But at the same time, uh, I don't know. I just want to give this a test run. If it dies, uh, the baby dies. I mean, it's not going to be a huge. There we go. We're at 10. Let's go. Up. I already closed the doors again so that it's able to, to get out. Uh, but if this baby dies, it won't be such a big deal because it's most likely going to be a very weak level. There we go. And... We are Are we? It has to be what two hundred health? Was it wrong? Does it have to be a hundred health? Just one bite? Is that enough? And did I mess this up? I don't want to bite it. Oh, I don't want to bite it. Oh, I'm gonna have to bite it. Just one little nip. Oh. 
If it died, oh my, I killed it. I killed it. I don't know what happened. Why it wasn't. Oh my gosh. What happened? Gosh, that's embarrassing. I just wasted a whole freaking. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, it's. That's that sucks. Was it because I was on its back? That might have something to do with it. That is just sucks. I was really looking forward to getting that Rhino. I have a feeling it's it was probably because Yep, nothing. Man. That sucks. That really sucks. Alright, I guess I'm going to take this back to base. And, I don't know, I'll probably take my RG out for another spin. See what else I can find. I'm going to have to use my other pheromone. I really wasn't wanting to use the other pheromone. But... I guess I guess I got to. Oh, man, I really don't know what went wrong. I feel like it's because I was riding it. I don't. I don't know what else could have. It could have been.
So yeah, as you can see from all of those previous clips, uh, for whatever reason, the Rhino uh, is bugging out and is not impregnating my uh, my T-Rex. So I'm going to definitely keep trying to get a Rhino Natha. It's just a bit of a process right now. My pheromones and recently my Arch just died. Uh, so yeah, I'm just kind of working around that, trying to expand my base. If you look. Here, you know, it used to be just down this. There's this whole room. I built up the ceiling, and then let's see, and then all this used to lead outside, and now it just leads to all of this. So I've been a little bit busy with all of this, but yeah, I'm gonna keep trying for any of that. I have to get a charge, you know, but uh. Yeah, that's basically, that's the long and short of it. No Rhino Natha. Bugged. Very, very buggy. Very annoying. Uh, but that's going to be it for this video. So thank you all so much for watching. Uh, it was a bit of a time gap between those two Rhino Natha taming attempts. And the conclusion of this video. I did a little stuff on the side. But, uh, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see everybody in the next video.